Friends, it is official. Another excited goat coffee company is coming to mid-Michigan. Joining me with all the yummy details is Josh Sharo. Josh, how are you? Great, thank you for having me on here today. Of course, we're so excited. I just love the cool background there. It is looking very spiffy. We're loving it. Well, congratulations. It was, it was either this or my spare bedroom, so we had to make, we had to make do. <laughs> of course. Well, it's a big congratulations. People are so excited about this. Tell me, why people keep on coming back for excited goat coffee yeah i think it's just a different atmosphere right yeah. it's a it's a little louder than normal uh there's some music playing yeah people are happy they're 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 just they're happy to be here so when people step in they expect that quiet calm atmosphere right. with coffee shops but you know this is this might be a little bit different than your average coffee shop oh i love it a little bit different than your average coffee i mean what what else do you want that's pretty unique tell me about some of the the, the coffee and also the treats that you offer there yeah we we love local uh, that's an important thing to us so we get all of our coffee from creation coffee in midland uh they roast it fresh for us they bring it to us uh it, when it comes in the bag it's roasted that same day so the bag is still warm and that means a lot to us the freshness of the coffee the quality of the coffee from creation is simply amazing and all of our cinnamon rolls they're gigantic cinnamon rolls oh. that we get from pettiford pastries here in essexville uh so you know being able to work with somebody in essexville somebody in midland we're really able to bring the freshest product possible i mean what else do you need besides a nice hot cup of coffee and a delicious yummy homemade cinnamon roll it sounds really awesome gosh tell me this josh do you have any fan favorites of the uh, with the coffee some favorite flavors yeah, right now, uh, we, you know, our, our oat milk and honey has been an ongoing uh, favorite. It's just oat milk and local honey and brown sugar and wow. cinnamon. And then we've also got um, our Kyle's Christmas, which is a caramel, vanilla, cinnamon uh, latte. And then, you know, for the everyday people that just want a cup of coffee, we've got some of the best uh, coffee that Creation Coffee offers as well uh, here at The Go. So you can get the fancy latte. You can get the, the Cool Whip on top you, or, or whipped cream on top. They don't let me out here much, so I don't really know. But the, the whipped cream on top and all the drizzles and all that stuff. Or you can just come get a regular old cup of coffee. Everybody's welcome. Josh, you have to stop. I'm about to jump into the screen and come get some right now. That sounds so delicious. You can believe I will be there. Okay, so tell us, it's time for the big reveal. When are you opening your new place? Yeah, we're really close. We're probably the uh, first week of February. Okay. Uh, on 916 North Euclid. It's right across from uh, Labadee Toyota yes. and next to the McDonald's on North Euclid. And, you know, with everything that's happening in the east side and the west side and bridges and, and everything that's happening in Bay City, it just seemed like the right opportunity to bring a local coffee shop to the west side of Bay City. So we're really excited to be there. Yeah. What's the date again, Josh? I, I was told before I started this not to say an actual date, but I'm going to say February 8th is my, okay. is my February date. February 8th. Oh, we got a little exclusive. I love it. Okay, so once <laughs> again, that is 916 North Euclid. That's on the west side of Bay City. So if you would tell someone, Josh, why they should come there, what would it be? Well, you know, you're going to get that freshness of the coffee with Creation Coffee. Like I talked about, that coffee that's roasted, um, when it's delivered January 25th, it's actually roasted January 25th. So it's wow. the freshest possible cup of coffee you could get. The coffee that we sell in the store uh, on the shelves that you can take home with you was never roasted less uh, more than seven days ago. So it's oh. always the freshest possible cup of coffee that you can get in. You know the atmosphere and yeah. and, uh, and and gigantic cinnamon rolls. I, I, I don't know um, what else we could possibly have. You know. Yeah, not your average coffee shop. That's for sure. It, Thank you so much, Josh, for joining me. And you have to know, I will definitely be stopping by. Not once, yeah. not twice, but several times. Appreciate you. Stop, <laughs> stop drinking that TV station coffee. Come get That's some good right. coffee. That's <laughs> right. Yes, you're absolutely correct. Thank you for sharing this with us. We can't wait for your big Thank opening. Congratulations. Thanks. Thank you so much. You're so welcome. If you have any ideas of what you would like to see on our show, you can send them to us at WNEM-4PMNews at WNEM.com. Just use the subject 4PM News Spotlight.